Greetings and welcome back one and all to this war of mine day 39 It is a food day and Boris has returned after clearing out pretty much Everything of any real worth in the construction site now Let's quickly get a couple of people fed the ones that are going to be sleeping uh, That means you as well Let's get you up there and uh, you as well Everyone scarf down your food. Uh, we'll have Arika take some herbal meds as well. Right, you're off to bed. Thank you very much for all of that delicious food, by the way. Let's get Boris fed up, and then you can go immediately go to bed as well. There we go. Ooh, got some food. Why don't you help us out with that? Right, let's get down there. Go ahead and eat. Then you're going to be staying up tonight. And... You set that back up with some fertilizer. Fantastic. Right, let's have you head down here. There we go. Go have your food, then grab your medicine. Then all should be well. Uh, do we have anything we want to do here? Not sure. Let me just quickly check. Do we have anything we want to make? No, not really. Let's go ahead and place some fuel in the fire, though. And have you take your herbal meds. Do we have any filters at all no we do not well damn and blast let's get you down onto a bed right marin go check the radio though i'm not certain that we're gonna have any kind of update at this point but uh, it's always worth checking uh what's the weather like that should be around here you may expect upcoming days to be cool that's fine and no, exactly the same. So we'll drop it onto classical music. Probably not going to be having it play for very long because there's very little for us to do tonight. We've got pretty much everything we can do done. So it is now just a case of uh, letting. Oh, no. Trader is at the door. Fantastic. Let's get up there. Is it every two days that you show up? It might be. Slightly sick. On meds. Recovering. Okay. What? What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you going? Are you on bad terms or something? Wasn't easy to get here, so let's make it worth the effort. Well, that all depends, really, on what you've got to trade. Well, take all the water. Yeah, you haven't got any... Ah, dread. I would have very much liked to have purchased some electronic parts, but it seems that that may be out of the question. Very well. Uh, we will trade this, and then... Hmm, these... And possibly... Ah, man, I don't want to trade any of that, really. I could trade a few of these. We'll take this... Oh, actually, that's not too bad. If I take that away and then we uh, trade for these instead... Oh, wow, okay, you'll take... So this water is worth more. I guess it's because it's in a larger stack is the only thing I can imagine. But, uh, all right, uh, yeah, I don't mind that one. Uh... Might even take these instead. Let's uh, continue to trade these. Yeah, I'm all, I'm all right with that deal. I would trade that down to the same amount as we've got uh, vegetables, but this is actually a fairly decent trade. Yeah, go on. Uh, is there anything else? We could take the remainder of these and all of those for some booze. Got to be kidding. Show more. Show more. Won't do try harder. Wow, you do ask for a lot there. I uh, want to try harder. Oh, that's one of the pistols, actually. Never mind. What am I trying to do? Uh, we could go for the fuel. Want to try harder? I don't really care enough about that. Okay, we can have a deal for four of our pure alcohol. We can get the rest of that. Might actually be better for me to take this instead, though. Want to try harder. Is that really... It's quite common, apparently, so this shouldn't be that hard. Trade you some of that. There we go. Okay, that seems like a reasonable deal. And even if it isn't, I'm happy to help you. I hope the snipers won't see you. So do I. You're kind of our lifeline, in a way. Right, Marin, we need more filters. Quite urgently now. We've got a little bit of time left in the day. So let's uh, get all of this going. Uh, how many of these can we make? Let's go ahead and make six. In fact, let's make nine. That'll take us all the way through for the next couple of days. And that'll keep you busy for the next couple of days as well. <laughs> right, I think that's all we're going to do. We're going to just go ahead and end this day for now. 
And uh, you only made it to three before the night was out anyway. You're still six, so you're going to still be sleeping in bed. You're going to be scavenging. You're going to be... Marin, you're on guard duty tonight, and Bruno is sleeping. Okay. Some feud, huge amount of weapons, possible trade, caution advised. Um... There's a little part of me that wants to... Oh, we could go back to Marco's corpse. I'm not, no, we'll, we'll wait for Arika before we do any kind of crazy stuff like that. Um, there's apparently no danger there anymore. I'm not sure. I'm not sure about that at all, actually. Uh, go to the military outpost, possible trade there. No, not yet. We, we're going to send uh, Boris on a trade run. We'll just uh, say hello to the uh, kindly doctors and nurses of this place. We'll take some of these as well. Should I take uh, medicine ingredients? Maybe they'll trade these? I don't know. Be worth it, though. Got a little bit of sugar. We could do with a lot more of that, and they're obviously electronic parts as well. <laughs> we could trade the snow, but I doubt they would take it. All right, okay. Well, uh, let's, let's make our way over there now and see what we can do. There's also the hotel that we can trade at. Alright, let's uh, go ahead and, and run in. The, these guys aren't likely to be aggressive to us. But uh, don't don't rush too much. Hey, you. Can you help? What's, what's the problem? If you find any medical supplies in the rubble, return them to the doctor. Uh, actually, I'm bringing medical supplies from other rubble. I'm that good. Are you here to donate supplies? If not, leave me alone. What? That's a bit harsh. Uh, we'll take the sugar. We can accept it, but we prefer medications or bandages. Exactly what we need. If you donate it, we can save more lives. It's an offer I'd expect. That's an offer I'd expect from a decent person. Uh, I'll give you more. Um, I mean, I'll take all of this. That's an offer. I'd, well, you can have that as well. Uh, can I get these as well? Uh, I'll take your books too, if you don't mind. I mean, I know I'm practically giving this stuff to them, but... Uh, well, you can have those back. I don't want to take all of your literature. You've got to have some for the patients. There you go, Sandu. You can, you can have a fairly good trade there. Two herbal meds and some bandages in exchange for a remarkable amount of stuff for us. Okay. Yeah, thank you. Maybe we'll have fewer deaths tonight. Well, Boris, how much room have you got in your backpack? You've got a little bit of room, so we'll uh, scavenge around to take some of the stuff from the loot piles, but uh, that will be it. Let's see, what else have we got? We're not going to steal from them. We've come this far with the hospital never having stolen anything. All I want to do is make sure that I can... Ooh, what is going on there? Oh, you possibly... Ah, maybe I can help. Oh, no. Someone's crying. I mean, I guess this is a hospital, so it's not too surprising, but... You all right? Was it you? It's better now. Guess I just needed that. Oh. Test story one. Dear Lord. Hello? I'm sorry. We have patients in more serious conditions. Okay. Fair enough. Test story three. No idea what you're talking about, fella. I'm going to keep moving on, but he's, he's shadowing me, which is a little bit of a concern. I wonder what's going on up here. Got some stuff that maybe I can grab. That patient wasn't looking good. I, I, I felt kind of sad watching the... Uh, don't mess with me. I'm not messing with you. What are you going on about? Hello. Prayer doesn't help. Well, maybe I can go and, and get rid of this rubble from around here. Oh, has this place been... Is this re more recent shellings? It's possible it is. Let's uh, zoom out a little bit. I can't see up there. I can't tell if I've been over this side before or not. I would need to check the upper levels, but it could have been that this place... Yeah, I'm absolutely certain there were more levels to this place. Has this place been recently shelled once again? Well, that would be tragic. 
I should have brought you a shovel. Sorry about this, Boris. You'll just have to do the best you can. You're slow but strong, so I would have imagined you'd have some sort of bonus, but uh, apparently not. Well, that looks like the nursery. But is this is this new damage around here? It could be. I mean, that looks different, but I really can't remember clearly enough. It's been so long since the last time we uh, came to the hospital. Boris is most of the way through this, though. We should have enough time to at least find out what's there before we move on. But the fact that the nurse was crying does really give me a, a strong impression that this was this was more recent damage. Well, I mean, you know, let, let's face it. Uh, if the nurse wanted to cry just because, it would be completely understandable in this kind of hellhole, but uh, still... Right, oh, we've got two meds. Uh, you know what? I'll actually give the, those to the uh, doctor. I'm just going to give them to him. If this place has been reshelled, then uh, it's the least we can do to try and help. Hello. Goodbye. You don't want to cause trouble here. Trust me. Uh, no, I, I, I believe you 100%. It is, in fact, not my intention to cause trouble. I actively would not want to do it. Hello, after the last shelling, we can't admit any more patients. Oh, wow, so yeah, it does actually seem like they were shelled. You can choose something for exchange or just help the hospital. No, this one's a freebie. Good. Have you got more? Have you got more? That... <laughs> I mean, I can appreciate that you've got a desperate need, but... Uh... <laughs> a thanks wouldn't go amiss. Really wouldn't. It, w it would possibly even increase the the odds of me doing the same in, in the future. But uh, oh, to be fair, if they, I, his nerves are frayed. He's just trying to keep people alive here in increasingly hostile situation. I, I can I can I can give him a break, I suppose. All right, let's get back to the base and see if if uh, people are happy that we did that. I hope they are. Day forty, we are into the forties. Okay, hopefully our cat burglar is uh, fit as a fiddle now. Alright, we've been raided. Someone tried to rob us. It was quite a tough group, but we managed to fend them off. Thankfully, they, we were all armed. None of us was wounded, and the attackers didn't steal anything. We were able to defend ourselves. Seems that Arika is starting to feel a bit... What, really? She only just got better. Ah. <sighs> Well, she might not have gotten better, I suppose. Go ahead, take real meds, and then, then have uh, a kip. Right. It is not a food day, but you shall be working on making some food. You, however, are going to be going to sleep. And so I... Well, you will after you put some uh, fuel on the fire. There we go. Right. Go ahead and get back to sleep, please. Right. You check on the radio, and then go to sleep as well. Let's get this food cooked. There we go. Should be able to get everyone rested and well. Hopefully you might be able to uh, go out on a mission tonight. I'm not sure. Okay, that's not new. And Ooh, this is new. We have a confirmation that the peacekeeping forces are indeed en route to pro uh, Pogren. We should expect ceasefire. Any day now. We are so close. So terribly, bitterly, depressingly close, considering that it really wasn't that long ago that both Marco and Pavle died. Right, you're hungry, but you're not going to eat tonight. Let's instead get down here, finish up making uh, the... Well, actually, no, no. Let's get you over here first. You should be able to make some... Well, that was a good little uh, slide there. Should be able to make some more moonshine. Uh, two bottles is fine. Then we can make that into pure alcohol. We could even possibly start making some herbal meds for trade with the, with the hospital. Perhaps just go and just give them stuff at this point. But... No. Work on that instead. Let's uh, check out. Is anyone happy about what we did? No? Guess they're just used to that kind of selfless behaviour from, from our house. It doesn't doesn't carry any weight anymore. Ooh, some's at the door. Hey, I need help. Please open. Okay, okay. 
Let's get up there now, Bruno. Let's not make the guys wait. We're coming, don't worry. We've got a reputation to uphold. Hello? Please listen to me. Hello. Hello, it's us again. The military intensified shelling of our area and we decided we need to reinforce our improvised shelter in the cellar. We've got the necessary materials, but we could use an extra pair of hands. Maybe you could help us? Yeah, of course. No, we, we completely understand how important that is. However, that does now mean that... Uh, oh, I'll check out their bios. They'll probably be, all be waking up soon. I'm glad we could repay our neighbours for their kindness. Oh, were they the neighbours who gave us the vegetables? Ah, oh, that, that is actually even better. I would have helped them anyway, but that, that's even better. Thanks to us, our neighbours will be safer. I'm glad we decided to help them. So am I. And Boris. Boris has no, no bio, really? Boris is content, though. Everyone is content except the coffee drinker. Why am I surprised? Alright, let's uh, go... Get the rest of these filters made. Actually, no. Let's go get this done instead. Let's get the uh, the, the water coming in. Because we're using a lot of it at the moment. Thank goodness we got three of these. We might have needed four, honestly. But uh, three will do. I think we'll we'll be good for the rest of the, uh, the game with what we've got. Uh, you'll never get over there in time. So just go ahead and continue work with the filters. Okay, and finally, let's get to work on this one. If we haven't got our cat burglar available for a mission tonight, I think we're just going to pass the night, though. I don't think there's particularly any reason why we should uh, go poking our nose outdoors when we've pretty much got everything that we need right here. We've got food for tomorrow already set up. Bruno is away. Yeah, I, I think we'll just have one person on guard duty tonight. And everything else should be alright. Let's go ahead and end the day. There we go. The night. Everyone is going to be here. Boris, for once, you can sleep through the night. Because you were never allowed to sleep through the night. Go ahead and guard the area, Marin. And we should be okay. We're just going to stay in tonight. Uh, no, no, no. You're sleeping as well. You're sick. Why would you want to be going out? Day 41. Food day once again. Bruno helped our neighbours reinforce their shelter and is now safely back. Oh, did he bring back uh, some some brews? That's pretty cool. Right. Where are you, Bruno? Bruno, go ahead and eat. Marin will eat after you. And everyone else will then eat after Marin. In fact, you guys both go over there. I'm not going to have them run. I just don't need to. And you are finally ready to go on a mission. I'm very, very pleased with this. Very pleased indeed. Alright, go go have a rest. You did some good work tonight. There we are. Oop, there we go. Get that set up. Actually, before you do, could you go over here and set up the uh, still? Thinking about it. Yep, set that up. And oop, uh, everyone's vying for attention. There we go. Just get those going. And we'll get that next one made as well. There we are. Are you all set there? Fantastic. Right, you two should be perfectly fine. You're hungry, content, or just hungry? Hungry and hungry and content. That's fine. Right, get that one going as well. And once this one is made, I may even be able to have Bruno make another two pure alcohol. Uh, can, do you need to sleep? No. Do none of you three need to sleep? Really? Oh, that's like, oh no, you do actually need to sleep, don't you? Alright. And then... Well, I guess you can just kind of hang around. You need to go eat, actually. Both of you do. And once this is done, we may be able to make another two. I'm not sure. I mean, with this much booze... I could send... Uh, I was going to say I could send someone to the uh, military place, but no, we don't We don't have uh, any more booze to make anyway. That's fine. Go and duck your head down there, mate. No, 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 no. Stay. Stay. There we go. All right. Let's, uh, let's go and show a new face at the door. 
He wants to see you before. Oh, he might have. I don't know. Wasn't easy getting here, so let's make it worth the effort. What have you got to trade? You have not got electronic parts. I consider this a grave failing on your part. I wonder. It would cost you. But how about this? Interesting. Want to exchange? No, won't do. Uh, it's very generous of... I guess we would get... Uh, I don't know. That might not be a good trade, or it might be. In either case, I don't need that trade, so I'm not going to make it. What I do want, though... Um, let's see. Need none of this. Wouldn't mind the extra ammo. And then I'll take these parts, I suppose. And I'll trade pretty much everything we can until we've got it. Very generous of us. Then you're not having that. I'll trade you something else. Uh, I'll take you one of these. Fine, we can have a deal. That's good enough for me. We've got some extra ammo. Uh, I could buy these, but no, I don't think we need them. Okay, well, thank you very much for uh, that. This part of town is dangerous, but I'll try to come again. Thank you. Right, okay, we're good, I think. Yes, yes we are. Well, that is actually pretty awesome. And it looks like our vegetables will be ready soon. So, it's actually getting a little bit cold. So, when you rush down there and you go check out the uh, radio for now as well. Got a little bit more fuel. Ooh, we've got no fuel, really. Well, that's going to be easy for us to make, considering how much timber we've got. Where's the timber? We've got 69 timber. Go ahead and make, turn 10 of that into fuel. It'll take you 2.5 hours to do. Classical music. Let's believe the same thing. Confirmation. Anything else? No, I doubt we're going to see anything else, so uh, I'll just leave her on that for now. And that is the end of this night, I think. There we go. We've got eight veggies waiting for us. All right, then. Now, the thing here is I can't... Well... Uh, I don't know, the military outpost, perhaps. Uh, no, no, I don't think so. I think we know what it has to be. We want to visit Marco's corpse, if, if nothing else. We want to do that. I'm not sure how these guys are going to respond to us now that they know that... Uh, I mean, I don't know if the, the fact that Marco went there... Will it will affect the way that this is all gonna pan out? I'm not sure, but uh, maybe they might just attack you on on sight. I'm not gonna be sending you with a weapon, you see, so that's a little bit of a, a little bit of a risk, too much of a risk in some ways. No, we're gonna go to the military outpost. Uh, says danger, but be careful. You never know what to expect from them. I know this is going to sound like a horrible thing. And I, I hate this kind of scaremongering. But I'm not going to send a woman to the military outpost carrying booze and cigarettes for trade. I'll send Boris instead. Call it what you will. But uh, let's make sure that... I'm not going to send you with a weapon. I don't want to intimidate them. We will send you with plenty of alcohol though. Uh, is there anything else that I can send with you? I don't have any cigarettes. Maybe we can trade for some stuff. We'll, we'll see how this goes. Go ahead. The nice thing with that, we can stack uh, essentially two moonshine bottles worth of materials. I've lost track whose side they're on. Okay. Hello? I would like to trade. Watch it. This is a restricted area. Better have some good stuff to trade. I do indeed have good stuff to trade. I think so anyway. Okay. Interesting. Want to exchange? Okay. A small flask of pure alcohol. You can drink it. You can trade it. You, or you can use it to produce meds. You've got a... Wow. I can just buy a weapon from you? Just I can, you, you will just flat out give me an assault rifle? That is just crazy talk. I'll take all of your water. I'm tempted to take it. Wow. I'm, I'm not even sure what would... The, the offer is too damn impressive. Can I take that? You will... Wow. You gotta kidding me. Show some more. 
Well, can I t give that back to you? Won't do try harder. Can I, can I just give you progressively less... We'll take less water until you agree to give me the gun and all your ammo? What kind of soldiers are you? Bojan? Maybe it's because it's got a similar name. Boris Bojan? Uh, maybe, maybe there's some... Uh, <laughs> drawing conclusions about people being related just because their names are so similar. Avak, you... That's classy. Oh, my lord. Okay, yeah, we're, we're going to make this trade. I don't want the gun, but it'll be brilliant for protecting us. And also, you know, the possibility of visiting the brothel. Yeah, that is what went through my mind when I first saw that they would trade an, opera or, uh, an operating uh, assault rifle. Though, you've got a shotgun. Mm. No, we'll go with the assault rifle for now. Deal. Okay, you did your civic duty. <laughs> I'm not coming with you. No, no, no. I'm leaving. Excuse, excuse me. What on earth's going on out there? Some shenanigans. I wonder if they would kill me if I tried to, to sell. Uh, we'll find out. You gonna kill me? Is Boris gonna be attacked? I'm fairly certain Boris could get out of here. Nothing worth taking. Oh, okay, he's back. Maybe he comes by every now and then. I'm, I'm not gonna take any more chances. We're leaving. Boris has done a, a good good bit of uh, trading there. I feel pretty happy with that return. I think this is going to be day 42. Wow. At this point, we could just pass the night until the time came. This was one lucky night. You won't believe what I found. A gun! I was given it by a soldier in exchange for that stupid stuff that we made ourselves out of sugar and water. Craziness. And... The game is broken. What? Oh, phew. We've been raided. Boris had been searching for supplies and brought back some interesting things. Oh, really? I done well again. Someone tried to rob us. It was quite a tough group, but we managed to fend them off. Thankfully, we were all armed. None of us was wounded, and the attackers didn't steal anything. Not that we uh, really need this weapon. We are people seem to be doing amazing well by themselves. All uh, right. Okay, you're gonna be grab some more food. I need you get down there. Continue making fuel. We need some. Uh, you go in. Actually, I need to wrap this episode up thinking about it. So, uh, yes, I will be doing that. In this episode, Boris has managed to get himself a crazy powerful gun from the military, which just doesn't make any sense to me, but uh, alright. And in the next one, hopefully we're not going to have to use it. But I am probably going to be sending out our cat burglar once she's, she's well again in order to pay uh, Marco's body a visit. I don't think it would be right to to win this game without without going back to his body at least once. I think it's the least we could do. But that is all for the next episode. I do hope you've enjoyed this one and will be joining me in the next. But until then, and as always, do take care.